I will change your life, oh yes, I am bound to. With hats and more, the clothing store, there's something new to put on you. Just a thing to make you sing, hats and more. Convenient with lots of heart, and once you've seen it, it's worth remarking. It's the hottest fashion in the colony. It's the only fashion in the colony. So get in here, it's a celebration, an incarnation of imagination. We're the only store where you get to see. Come and see our socks and shoes and shorts and sports. I know you'll love the jackets too. Bowler hats and dapper spats. And you'll love Underwear, wading boots, and pajamas. Fancy gowns for your mamas. You and that will find in there. Trust this more. Listen for you. Try some clothes. They will transform you. All in imagination to change the whole mold. solitary, itty-bitty little thing that could go wrong with this plan. Oh look, a potential customer. Uh, a clothing store? Welcome. A naked mole rat wearing clothes. you could use a pair of these sneakers. What do you think? They scream fun, but whisper sophisticated. I'm telling everyone. <laughs> what a nice mole, spreading the news about my store like that. Newsflash. Wilbur has opened up a store that actually sells clothing. Is this not Nikki novelty real, or is it just fake nudes? And more importantly, under where's it all coming from? Well, Stark, there's an isolated high fashion front that features a flash flat of falling point where floors, fleece, fans, and full figure fashion. But only a hat's more Wilbur's yuck clothing store. Ooh. What are the chances the tunnel will experience a future freakish falling fashion force? 0.00%. Whoa. What's happening? Do you feel that? Oh. Oh. There is a margin of error. <laughs> a mole rat like that has to be stopped. If that mole rat has any friends, they better get to it. Wilbur? Oh, hi guys. Hi, Wilbur. Shh. Oh, I mean, ew. Wilbur, we saw you on the news today. What do you think you are doing? I'm happy.
having a sale. I do love a sale. Sale is over, Wilbur J. Morat. Come with us. Oh, are you looking for an in-house clothing consultation? Because I think you could use a pattern to contrast your demeanor. Maybe a paisley or... Enough! It's time to restore your tunnel vision before it's too late. Where are we going? We're going to help you, Wilbur. Oh, boy. I have to go. I forgot an accessory. What? Wilbur J. Morat, you are nothing like you came in for me! Yes, you are. I'm Where's Wilbur? Good grief, you target him. Oh, what was I thinking? No, what was that? Well, no. I just I can't believe it's the most incompetent role you could have written the whole thing. Please. I don't know, man. I just thought maybe if we could win a circle, it would do something. Okay. That's all for time. They dress the whole body. Oh! So, why are they called tailors? Well, they dress the tail, but they also dress the whole body. Oh, okay. So, why don't they call them flyers? Quiet! We're here! in his shoes. No! We want you to put yourself in his bare, fleshy feet. The bare, fleshy feet of the most regal, the most magnificent, the most naked, naked Borat ever! Just look at him! You know what? You're right, Grande. Grandpa does look great. Yeah! Grandpa does look regal. Dude! Grandpa does look magnificent. You go, Wilbur! Grandpa would also look great and regal and magnificent in a casual shirt and some summer slacks. Oh, he's just not getting it! Naked! Mole! Rats! Don't! Wear! Hello! Owie, you hurt my feelings. <laughs> That's it! Now it's time to do something very Jurassic and very, very last resort. Now it's time to activate the Grandpa Grand Panic Button! The Grandpa Grand Panic Button? The Grandpa Grand Panic Button? Yes. Do you know where the Grandpa Grand Panic Button is, Fenty? It's not on me. You know, it would be great if we had, like, this this thing to like hold stuff in and yeah uh, yeah that could work. We could call them a um, ha 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 Will someone just go get the button on it? it. Hmm, where did you put it, Eddie? <laughs> Fun fact: cargo pants have. Pocadocaraka pox, and you can put pretty much anything you want in them and still have your hands free. Granted, they're not exactly fashionable, <laughs> but they are useful, you know, for dads and stuff. Why couldn't you just let things stay the way that they are? We have everything we need. We have music. We have lyrics. Now suddenly you want to wear clothes? Nothing even rhymes with clothing. How about gloving? You're digging yourself in a hole, mole. Here it is! The Grandpa Grand Panic Button! Okay, hold it. Okay, don't drop it. Okay, don't drop it. I'm not gonna drop it. Don't drop it. Oh, what if you drop it? Just do it. Don't drop it. I've never pressed the Grandpa Grand Panic button before. I don't remember the last time any mole has. I'm nervous. You're nervous? It's almost too much to imagine. Me standing before the actual great Grandpa. 
Wait, you mean Grandpa's father? Yeah, I thought the panic button was for <laughs> Grandpa, not for Great Grandpa. What are you two talking about? Dude, you said Great Grandpa. That's what I heard. Yeah, as in Great Grandpa, not Great Grandpa. Oh, oh, oh. I'm confused. He's great. Who's great? Grandpa. Grandpa's father? Grandpa's great. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Grandpa's great what? What? That's what we're asking. Okay, okay, let's just start from the beginning. Yeah! We are naked! 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 No red light! Not the beginning! That's it, I'm just gonna press the button! Officer Worker Mallrat, Secret Service, Grandpa Protection and Vision Reporting. Who has pressed the Grandpa Grand Panic button as to summon the great, as an impressive Grandpa? Oh, I get it! It's a modifier! <laughs> it is I, Grande Mallrat, along with tall and venti mole rat who request the judgment and the wisdom of the great grandpa. I'm here too, even if I'm not sure I want to be. <laughs> I'm so glad I thought of this. Fine. Dig your own tunnel. Goose flesh, this is Longtooth. Prepare big tail for entrance. Roger that, full frontal. Stand back! For he will come before you the greatest naked mole rat ever in all of his Wilbur's 